Well, Connor, it must be great to be right back in the thick of things after a stop-start time at Charlton to come in and to be yeah right in the centre. It must be great. Uh, it's good. Though. I've also had quite a difficult well had a difficult start to the season. Uh, injuries and not playing many games. So to come in and kind of um, play the majority of the minutes uh, since I've came in here has been really good, and that's it's, um, it's what I've needed really. Yeah, that's easier said than done to go from not having played a lot to then week in, week out, sometimes three games in a week. Is your base level of fitness, is it something that is always quite good? Yeah, that's probably like one of my main strengths is just me being like kind of fit all the time in terms of like my ability to run. Um, luckily, touch wood, I've, I've never really had any muscle injuries in my career, so to come back in usually kind of need a, like a wee phased return in uh, with minutes, but luckily, because I've not had many muscle injuries, um, I've been able to kind of hit the ground running and, and just play game after game, which has been good. Your debut must have been a funny one. Typical, really, that you end up with your used debut at Lincoln. It must have been really strange coming up against so many players and being at a place you knew really well. Uh, yeah, it is strange, you know, especially because, um, you know, I, I, I was there at the start of the season with Charlton and I came on for like a few minutes. So actually playing the game was really good and to play against, like, uh, some good players, uh, boys I know, it was weird, but yeah, I enjoyed it. Yeah, and clearly the the results, the overall picture, it hasn't gone as you'd have wanted so far, but I think as we've been saying over a, a number of weeks, there's a sense that the, the ideas, the performance levels are there, it's kind of obvious really, you just need the goals. I to be honest, there's, there's, there's not been any games really uh, that we can say we've been battled in. Um, we've been right in every single game, we've played well in a lot of the games and we should have took a lot more points than we have but we're in the situation that we're in, we've not taken the points but I think with us playing well in the majority of those games it, it still gives you belief knowing that you can go into the games and win them because we've played some top teams and we've played really well against them and probably deserve more. Um, so the belief's still high despite the results and I think um, every, everyone feels that. Yeah, big week coming up. Is that where the experience of someone like you or uh, Ryan Bennett or uh, Michael Morrison, you can really make that pay? Yeah, hopefully. Obviously, I've been in this situation before. Um, it was quite similar to my time last year. We had maybe a few more points, but we were in the relegation zone uh, maybe just a bit before this or, or uh, around about a similar time, and we managed to get ourselves out of it. So, you know, it's, it's no by no means like a, a foregone conclusion. Um, and I think... Having that experience of being there and doing it will hopefully help and uh, hopefully everyone can stay calm and we can just take it game by game, hopefully win tomorrow and then, and then pick, up, pick up on that. Yeah, for Lincoln, similar really to the use in that you had a really good season and then it dropped off and I guess psychologically it makes it even harder when you've been high up the league before. Yeah, it does um, and I think the expectations of other people as well can maybe make it a bit more difficult because they uh, you know, expect you to, to, to be doing... Uh, a little bit better but we've just got to focus on what's what's been said in, in house um, you know the manager's been really good at, uh, at keeping the, the spirits high keeping the belief up and I think the players are really feeling that and you know we're, we're confident going into tomorrow because it's, it's a big game and it's one we're all looking forward to Yeah the confidence is huge isn't it and you can't dream it up or it, it is what it is but if you can maintain some level of belief and confidence then it, it makes a huge difference yeah, definitely. I think that's everything in football is, is the belief and the confidence. Um, and if, once, if you've still got that, it's, it's huge because, um, you know, you can look at the result on Saturday and say, OK, we lost, but we played, we played really well in the game and probably within chances, um, you know, we deserve to win it. But I know people might not want to hear that, but that's what we've got to look at it now because, um, you know, once, once your confidence is gone, it's really tough. So I, I know for a fact that everyone... Um, you know, believes that we can win tomorrow and and then hopefully pick up uh, and, you know, can, can uh, get a wee run of results going. Have you enjoyed in particular playing at the Abbey? I think of the, the Ipswich game or Oxford the other day and the, the atmosphere, despite some of the difficulties, has been really good. Yeah, I've loved it. I've loved it. Um, it's like an old school kind of stadium uh, and, I, and I love them uh, the most probably playing in them. The atmosphere is really good. The pitch is tight. Um, you know, it's 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 been really good. Play some good teams in there as well. Uh, had some good performances ourselves, so I've I've really enjoyed it. And with these, with these, gonna say high pressure, probably not quite the right phrase, but when you get a game where there's so much riding on it, typically in your career, is that something you've enjoyed? Whether it's up the top, down the bottom, wherever it might be. 
this is, this is, what you're in football for um, to play these big games. Um, I think everyone looks forward to it. You get that wee buzz in your stomach. So if you didn't have that, then it's it's pointless. So um, I, I'm I'm really looking forward to the end of the season and, and all the games. Hopefully we can I can stay fit and, and you know make a good impact in it.